Hello, family and friends. Welcome into your spiritual nourishment. I am your shaman empress, aka the shaman hummingbird. It is your daily message. It is May the 25th, guys. My daily messages are timeless messages. So whenever you're going to see this message, guys, it will be appropriate to whatever situation you're connecting with. All right, so let's jump in, guys. Keep in mind real quick, I could be picking up the energy of you and your person. Also, the energy can fluctuate back and forth. So only take the part that resonates with you and leave the rest because that's for another family member that is here. All right, guys, let's jump into the message. All right. I will be also calling on the sign and energies that I see. It could be your person's sign, guys, or it could simply be the energy that they are in. So I was pulled to my spirit message. Guys, <clears throat> I'm sorry. I just woke up. <laughs> I got some things to do today, so I, I jumped right on before, you know, my little morning ritual or whatever. Um, but, um, we're going to, um, pull a, um, spirit message, okay, an animal spirit message for you guys and see what, um, animal spirit guides are around you guys and what you need to know. All right, spirit messages for the collective. Also, guys, remember to check off for sign placement for other messages. There's a link below, guys. You, yeah. all right, spirit for the, oh, dang, all right. Clever, you are swift and smart. Solutions to problems are easily found. Always listen to your instincts. That's also your intuition. Resources around you. Be open to romance. Boom. And that's what I was hearing. I was just going to say, someone here is being sneaky and clever to get back in your energy. This person, someone's being sneaky, child. I, uh, yeah, honey, because they want to take action towards you. Someone could be being sneaky, could be planning something. I just heard plot and planning. All right, to get back in your energy, to get get you back is also what I just heard. Now, this was in reverse. I'm getting Ganesha Vaz from this card. Okay, greatness. Someone didn't listen to their intuition. And they damn sure ain't listened to the spirit, guys, especially the demigods, because I'm picking up on Ganesha's energy. Yeah, I got to say something. Y'all's ancestors is cutting up. Yep. So someone here, <laughs> I've been getting this off and on all week. They was for the streets, child. I just got to tell you. Um, they could have had a lot of suitors. A lot of you guys also have a lot of people watching you guys as well. This person's keeping up on you. I do believe that this person had other options. All right. I just heard masculine. Deep love. You give good love. All right. So someone, yeah, they're in love with you, child. Swans make for life. So you know, Grace. Um, so this person, this is someone, yeah, this is definitely someone from your past. Yeah. For you guys that are resonating with the twin flame part of this, the twins that are here, because you can't stop being a twin. It's just impossible. Either you're going to be with your twin or your soulmate. But for those of you that are twins, someone didn't possibly recognize you. Nope. And we got peacock energy, Oshun energy um, here between you and them. I'm going to pull that over here. And we have rebirth in reverse. Someone here could have, I got to say this, someone here could have like refused the call between you guys. I've been getting out a lot. Um, for some of you guys, this person just couldn't see you. For whatever reason, I, I heard toxic. Yeah, they had too many other suitors. They were blinded by that for a lot of you guys. Also, I just heard fake ass friends. Some of you guys got to watch your friends, honey. Family and friends are the worst. If you notice, those are the first two people that you have to just kind of like, uh, you know, <laughs> let them know what it is. And once you conquer that, you conquer all. That's the real truth. It's always in the family. Look at the Last Supper. It's always in the family. So some, yeah, you got fake family, honey. You got a lot of fake people around you. Fake family, fake friends, but they all watching your ass. All of them. All right. <laughs> Woo, chow. All right. Let's get y'all some terror. So that's what we got going on so far here. Yeah, honey, because you didn't cut their ass off. 
Yep, point blank period. All the lines, there's a lot of lies and gossip. You guys need to um, protect your energy as well. So that's something, yeah, because you found out they ass was fake. Ding, ding, confirmation from the universe, honey. And not only that, you also knew they was juggling you. Some people here could be acting funny towards you because at the end of the day, they talk shit on you behind your back to your family, to your friends. And sometimes it's your friends and your family talking about you to each other, honey. They could even be talking about what you're doing, how you make your money, um, you know, all that other bullshit. Even in your relationships, man or woman, it don't even matter, yep, period, and where you're going. And at the end of the day, uh, what God has for you will always be for you. It's unexplained and unapologetic. That's just what it is. All right, spirit. That's the message that we're getting so far. I'm getting so damn hot, child. Yeah, honey. So they all watching you. And if they hate, then let them hate and watch the money pile up. That's what I just heard. Biggie said, and if they hate, then let them hate and watch the money pile up. I believe that was Biggie. All right, we got the Ace of Pentacles. Sorry, guys. I'm, I'm just waking up. <laughs> you could be an herb sound. All herb sounds are here. Yeah, because you got a fresh new start. You in your bag, and you are doing you unexplained and unapologetic that might be what i gotta name this goddamn me what i tell you child you can have air sounds around you too they all watching you i just heard watching the bag child let them watch partnerships relationships they all looking they all here they all looking child tell them all sit down take a seat take a take some notes get their pens out baby yeah terror moment and here it is <laughs> they all swole Shit. Buy them a drink. Tell them heaven on you. Damn. They watching the shit out of you. Damn. I mean, it's a lot of people watching you, honey. Yep. Because you in your bed. You're in your awesome. I just heard North Note when I touched this card. You're in your purpose. You're calling as well for a lot of you guys. Um, Yep. Lovers. You got a lot of suitors, too. I just want to say... This too, for you guys that are open up to your calling out on your gift, I do notice the energy around, and I hate this, where other readers go up against each other. Don't fall for that energy. Don't. I can't stand that. And I got to say this, no shade, especially to, like, the black readers. It's just like, why do we always bash each other or you know, this thing? We all have purpose in calling. You know, we all read. We all are talented on different levels. We're all different. We all see different things. That's the, that's the part of, of the beauty in it, okay? Like, I mean, damn. I mean, it's almost like music. Everybody sings, but you got so many different singers. You got Beyonce. You got Ariana Grande. You got Rihanna. They got a different way. Respect that shit. Just respect it. Like, you know, Six of Cups. This is good karma coming in for a lot of you guys. We got Scorpio, Gemini, Fire Energy here, Cancer. Yep, because you want a new journey. You answered your calling. In your purpose, I just heard. It female or masculine. You're an emperor. That's just what it is. They can get mad, kick fucking rocks. I wouldn't give a shit. I will let them get mad. Be mad. Stay mad, shit. And if they ain't talking about you, then what they talking about? The fuck? Yeah, honey. You gonna be coming together. Some of you guys are gonna be getting new relationships and new partnerships. I did see this card. Hold on. Yep, I knew it. A lot of you guys been blocking a lot of people out and off because you're a high priestess. You also know this secretly for you guys. And um, a lot of you guys as well are, uh, like I said, in your calling. Some of you guys are definitely um, could have a public platform. You could also speak. But this is definitely you on a new journey, on your new calling. A lot of you guys are um, opening up to your high priesthood. There's many levels to that. I'm gifted in a couple different areas, all right, which I'm excited about opening up on my channel. I can't wait. Mm -hmm. All right, um, as well. Also, this was written in the stars. This is karma. Whatever you planted, the seeds I heard that you planted, it's now coming in. I'm seeing my cards, and that's crazy because they were showing me them earlier. So let's get that, my cards that I'm seeing them. Um, this is definitely... Um, work coming in is also partnership also learning new partnerships coming in partnerships business partnerships as well and all of that what's going to do honey is bring in the bag you want to learn something teach be able to teach people things and also be able to learn things also your discernment on what deserves your energy and what does not i want to see something because i'm seeing my cards 
Yeah, honey. Yeah, the sun and the stars, baby. The um, it's unlimited. I heard unlimited possibilities. What is this spirit? What do you want to show me? Oh, oh, honey, I can't make this up. Cause you give good love, except love. What I tell you, season harvest, and this is what they were showing me. Thank you, spirit. Whatever you planted is coming to fruition, honey. You got the bag. I just heard that. And you're going to get love as well. It's all here. We're going to clarify some things because I see some shit. Don't worry about that. The ancestors have been talking to you for you guys. You will be getting assistance from the higher realms, from the ether. So be careful. All right, guys. Also, make sure that's why it's important for you to protect your energy from the haters. All right, what I tell you. Boom. Can't make it up, baby. All right. Yeah. Some of you guys um, need to connect with Mother Gaia to get the intuition from the ancestors. All right. When you do that, you're going to be able to listen. Um, Gaia, also known as Kaya, um, is going to um, give you some downloads from the spirit realm. You can also do this. I always tell you, you can take your feet off and simply just step in the grass. You can meditate. You can pray. Groundwork, planting, all those kind of things help, guys. And it's going to help you open up and even see more. Your gifts are being sharpened and your intuition is also being high. And I just heard hibernation and rejuvenation. I can't make this up. That's why your guard needs to be up because you're you're getting another assignment. Some of you guys, you're, you're extending to another level. That's why it's important. I know I sleep with crystals. I have crystals all around me. But cell on night crystal every time I see this card. Um, some of you guys need to, blue is the color of communication in spiritual realm. So you might want to put some blue sheets on your bed. Um, I work well with colors as well. But cellulite, I keep that all around me. Cellulite crystals, guys, I will always tell you this. Um, you know, some things you're going to just hear me say, um, it's just me beating it in us. But the cellulite and the dragon blood is something that I keep around me. That also helps with sleep and protection and groundwork. I have a big cellulite stick here. Um, also, rose quartz and dragon blood. Um, tambourine is also good stones to keep as well. Obscene is a really big it's a little bit more shinier. That's really good stone as well. Amethyst. And I have an aqua crystal there as well, guys. So connect with your crystals. They also help with protection here. Um, but, I, yeah, they're talking shit on you. So let's get that message because I want to know. Yeah. Family and friends, honey. But they all watching you. Ten of Pentacles. That's family. <laughs> And friends, five of swords, what I tell you, all talking shit. And everybody loves to see her till you can see they fake ass. What is the um, ten of wands? Mm. Ten of wands, spirit. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Seven of cups. The joker. <laughs> they tried to fool. Yeah, honey. They tried to fool you. Some of them could have. Um, yeah, they fake as hell. Yeah, even I told you, partnerships, love, even ex-lovers, is it, it could be like you know, in regret for the way they treated you. Yep, nine of swords, and now these people could be like, um, they know they fucked up and they know they treated you wrong. Is what it is. Yeah, two of ones and a joker card. Some of them could be deciding to reach back out to you. Some people might even want to talk to you. You need to. You know, um, just be careful, protect your energy, because some of them only want to get in your energy because they see you doing good. That's just what it is. That's a tower moment, part of it. What is a tower moment? Also, you do have a new love coming in. I just saw that. Oh, yeah, because you've been healing, child. You've been healing. Also, affirmations help. I see affirmations every day. You can also hang affirmations up around your home. That's going to help guide you and get you through, too. All right? Anything you put in the universe, you can manifest it, guys. Affirmations or words. So when you are um, using that, you can also write down affirmations. Ding, ding, confirmation from the universe, honey. You got to understand spelling. Spell is in spelling. Ding, ding. So when you're writing affirmations, those are high vibrational energies. Um, it is you using alchemy. That's why affirmations are very important because you're telling the universe. You're letting the sun know. You need to... Um, Get up and say your affirmations and pray early as the sun rises. Let put it on the sun and let the sun spread that shit through the universe, through the land, and manifest. Okay, that's a good way uh, also to do that. What's this spirit? Oh, yeah, honey, I told you, King of Cups. Yeah, people know they fucked up. You have um a lot of suitors coming back in. Yeah, um, you you're someone. 
from your past, past, past as well here. Okay, there, uh, yeah, you have a couple people considering. You also have someone that you probably totally forgot about. It's also what I'm seeing here. I mean, it's probably it's been a long time since you talked to this person. They also been watching you. Damn, you don't know this. Mm -mm. Yeah, all these people, they want you back. Yeah, seven of pentacles. They see you. They see you. Yeah, they see you. Nine of Pentacles. A lot of you guys, you ain't been dating. You ain't been doing nothing. You ain't even been, you know, doing it. You just been doing you. And that's okay. Me too, child. So I know. Sorry, guys. You guys know when I channel energy, I burp a lot. My apologies. We got the Prince of this. Somebody does want to reach out to you to something that could start off small, her turn big. Yep. Ace of Wands for a new start. Sexual energy is here. Someone here with this, but some of you guys will be getting married. That is year six of the cosmos. All right. Spirit, can I see this? What is, um, let me see that first. Thank you. Yeah, honey. <laughs> this is all sideways. Yeah. Someone here feels like a fool. Yep. And, um, for a lot of you guys that's resonating with the twin flame soulmate energy. <laughs> Yeah, someone here, they fucked up and they know they have. I, I, I picked up on that earlier. But you are, will be getting a new suit or a new lover. I just heard soulmate. Yep, nine of swords. It could be worrying for... Yep, the real card. This also could be um, worrying for you guys that are twins. This, your twin could... Your twin might even know that you're going to get someone else. Now, it, they might still come back and challenge that shit. So you might have a choice. I've been picking up on that. As well, some of you guys will have a choice. I ain't gonna lie, when that happens, it's tough. It is, but it's your choice. What's that spirit? Mm. Mm. Okay, yeah, I told you because you got a lot of suitors, baby. Yes, you do. You the Queen of Wands. For a lot of you guys, um, the Queen of Wands is very sexy, sexy, attractive as well. Also very intuitive for you guys that are resonate with that part. And there you go. Again, let me show you how beautiful you are, baby. See? This is you. I'm also picking up on monk energy. You're definitely tapping into the demigods. You could have also... Some of you guys could have been like a monk in your past life. You might know that already. Yeah, see, because you wifey material. Yeah, the hair fun. You somebody you get someone here will be married. I don't know if you're gonna marry your twin or your soulmate. Um, what is this? Yeah, two of two of pentacles. There's a lot of people, um, suitors after you that is juggling even how to Yep, I told you. Ooh, child, the king of ones and the king of cups on how to even approach you. Fire and water energy. Um, the King of Cups is Scorpio, Libra, and the King of Wands is um, Cancer and Leo. Now, to break down a little bit of the King of Cups, the King of Cups is the King of Emotions. This person is going to love you unconditionally and limitlessly. Now, I do see Spirit show me something. I got to see what that is. Um, this King of Cups could be tied into some things or tied down to something. I also see a cup falling out his hand here. Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to check him out. We'll check out the king of ones. There's somebody here you could be dealing with that doesn't have any facial hair. And there's someone here that has braids, even dreads maybe, and does have facial hair um, for you guys in the past that is resonating with that. Let me see some. Hold on. I'm being shown my cards, guys. Wait a minute. You know, I do exactly what Spirit says. What is that? Mm. Yep, sad news. Ooh, all right. So the King of Cups, this person's going to come back and love you unconditionally, but there is some sad news. They could be a little bitter about. They might have had to spend a lot of money on a situation. I am seeing a female. What is the sad news? Mm. Someone here could be going through a divorce. Yeah, and it could be costly, costing them. Yeah, because uh, I heard pre they didn't get a prenup, so the, their their finances could be a little bit tampered with. Is what I just heard. What is this King of Wands? And what is that? Mm. High honor. Yep, this is someone who has a lot of respect for you. Ooh, child, a rich man. Now the King of Wands is also a leader. 
Okay, someone that people look up to. And if he's not established, he's extremely inspired. And he will be as long as he stay on his path. So a lot of, yep, long road. As long as he stay on his path here. Yep, and meaning. Um, for a lot of you guys, it's been a long time. Like I said, I was picking that up. Since you talked to this person. Yeah. That's from your past. Yeah, that's going to shock you. Yeah. Um, it could have been a long road. A lot of things that came up between the both of you guys. You're not expecting that. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's been a little while here. Um, yeah. Like you guys totally didn't have any contact with that person. Yeah. Because they lied to you. But they want to come back and speak some kind of truth to you. What's the high priestess? Mm-hmm. Something on the high priestess spirit. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, you see, you got to be aware of people that are coming in as opportunists as well. Because, honey, you're going to get the bed. And they all going to sit back to see it. Yep, they sure is. So you got to be careful with that. Yeah, a lot of people, they're going to be swole. Some people going to even cry over you. I just heard family as well. Yeah, because they were all tricky magicians. And I heard betrayal. And I'm seeing my cards. Mm-hmm. We're going to pull from them as well. Yep. And your discerning needs to be up. Yep. Yep. And your discernment's up because you don't, I heard you don't trust nobody. I don't blame you. I don't either. Now, it's okay to forgive, but you ain't never got to fuck with nobody again. And you ain't never got to trust them again. But if you, it's okay to forgive because forgiveness is for you. It's really not for them. Yep. Because you'll be moving on. I'll be moving on. Oh, moving on. You're moving on. Prince of, what I tell you, the Prince of Wands, honey child. Yeah, on your new journey. That's just what it is. And you ain't got time. Leaving where they at. Hang man, child. <laughs> I'm seeing my cards. Let's see what's going on down here. Yep, because you're all focused on your dreams, child. Yep, and you've been doing this in solitude. Also, Spirit could have told you to be in solitude. That's also important because um, you got to know how to protect your energy. And sometimes that is you going um, in solitude, groundwork, so you can hear Spirit, hear self, higher consciousness. But I, what I tell you, movement, baby, towards your dreams. Yeah. What is the emperor? Some of you guys got a lot of suitors in the emperor after you as well, honey. Aries energy. What is the emperor? Mm. Yep. Oh, my God. I told you. Regret. I was seeing this card. They were showing me this card. Someone regret. Somebody's in regret about you, child. And they are longing for you. You could have walked away from this person for similar reasons. I do see that. And they want to get your ass pregnant. So be careful. Now, emperors are um, established. Their fathers are dead. They um, have things. They have resources. They have connections. All those things. This person does want to give you an apology. When I touch this card, I just hurt your flowers. They want to give you your flowers. Okay. So, like I said, some of you guys got a choice, especially for you guys that are representing, because I'm picking up on Empress and Emperor energy. So, some of you guys, you know, you want to have a choice whether you uh, want this person back or not. All right. If this is your twin. Yeah. But there is a lot of passion here, honey. All right. This person has been healing and re Yeah, they have. Yeah, but they had to release something because they were stuck. They just could have even been a partnership or relationship that they had to get out of. It could be a mindset, but this person's coming because they want you to trust them again so you guys can move forward. So, okay. I told you. A karmic partner. That's what it is. They had to release yourself from a karmic cycle or partner. But this person wants to communicate with you. Okay. What is this Six of Cups? What is this Six of Cups spirit? Scorpio energy. You can have a Scorpio placement or um, connecting to Scorpio. Yep, new perspective. What I tell you, good karma. A new outlook on life and you're going to be getting um, the bag. Gifts. Doing you. This is good karma. There's not all, there's good and bad karma, honey. Oh, didn't I tell you what I tell you? Priority and portrayal is also here. I told you, a lot of people, you got good karma coming in and people wish they would have made you a priority instead of portraying you. I just saw so, child, what I tell you, look on the bottom, damn it, I told you, where's my damn it button at? I ain't used it in a while. Damn it, you're stressing me out. Child, yeah, so like I said, you're going to have a choice. 
Uh, um, your partner, your twin, um, guys might already know that. I, you know, because of what they did, that's probably, I heard they're not going to take no for a, a answer. It might not be that easy because they know you're guarded and they know they upset you. And they just want a chance to show you that they, that you could trust them. That's why, yeah, that you can really trust them. Even when y'all walk, y'all might do this. I have done that with um, one of my exes. When we hold hands, we didn't hold hands like that. We held pinkies like this um it was uh, when i was in high school you know little cute stuff but yeah you know you guys are going to build trust with this person whether this is your twin coming back or your soulmate this is this is the mission for each other i love it yeah with um new perspectives decisions and options on how you want to move forward in your life and connect and make a family um like i said you're going to get married to to this person as well a lot of you guys got marriage coming in. I see that here. All right. I'm going to just pull some love oracle messages real quick. Okay, spirit. Some love oracle messages for the collective. Oh. Yep, very soon. Very soon. This is going to be happening very soon. And like I said, new love for a lot of you guys. And, um, yeah, you... Uh, some of you guys, this is someone coming back that you were separated from. Yep, there's a, still a lot of passion and chemistry. That's just what it is. Anything else from this deck spirit that you would like the collective to know? Ooh, yeah. Yep, what it was worth. This is going to be whatever happened. Like I said, you have been doing you. You ain't been doing much. So it's going to be worth the wait, honey. It's going to be worth the wait. Even with this person coming back, you guys, it was worth the, It's going to be worth the wait. This person's going to, I just heard, blow your mind. It's going to, yeah, you're going to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. That's just what it is. Express your love and engagement. What I tell you. What I tell you. Um, so that, that is coming in. Some of you guys, you're going to have to keep an open mind here because I'm also seeing, um, as well, um, a little bit of deception here. Okay, and I, what I'm getting from that, I got to be, and I look at that, boom, soulmate coming in. What I'm getting from that is someone here, you know, I, I heard little white tails. So someone here could, you know, tell you little, yeah, little, I can't make this shit up. There it is, because they want action. So they might tell you, you know, there's a truth in the lie is what I just heard. So they might give you just enough, but not give you everything, because at the end of the day, they want you back and they're scared you're going to run off. So, you know, you got to kind of take it like that. See? But you're in your Ace of Pentacles. Abundance. So, you got to know that. Taurus energy there. So, yeah, that's it. All right. Let's pull. Let's end this out with some oracle messages for you beautiful people. Mm. Yeah, honey. Yep, Orca song list. So, I just heard someone wants to write you a song. Okay. Yeah, okay. Emperors could be, um, you know, those kind of people take oath, even in the industry, office, lawyers, doctors, all that kind of thing. So you could be dealing with an artist for some of you guys, singer. It could be a rapper, news, raven. I told you the messengers or the birds are messengers. A lot of you guys, when you're connecting to... Mother Gaia, Kaya, you're going to get it. Yeah, power. Yeah, you're going to get that energy that you need to manifest as well. All right? And we got um, um, equality seahorses. Seahorses also make for life. So just know that. And this is going to be pure peace, a very peaceful relationship coming in for you guys. So that's pretty dope. All right, guys, I love this. This is your um daily reading this is what i got for you guys so congratulations like i said i'm gonna say this for a few more times we're on year six and we're approaching the six months very secret and sacred numbers so this is dope all right guys don't forget to like subscribe and share to the channel i am a high priestess and high priestess need energy to pull messages so please that's another way to put your energy on the channel guys also everything you need to know is in the description box below um if you would like to make a donation guys or any personal readings i appreciate all your love and support the donation and the reading guys and um we're gonna keep growing i love you all stay dope i'll catch you in your next video upload ashay